Mohan family. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Moments with Baji Mutlanti. If you are my returning subscriber, thanks a lot for stopping by. And if you're new to my channel, please do make sure that you hit that subscribe button as well as that notification bell so that you won't miss any of my future uploads. I go by the name of Baji Batara Raisi. They you know that standard procedure. So as you've already seen the title of the video today, I'll be dishing out or rather I'll be unpacking the 10 tips of, you know, self-care. So <clears throat> it's basically 10 self-care tips that I'll be unpacking today. So without any further ado, let's get straight into those tips. So you might be wondering why am I doing the, okay, this kind of content. So this is um, what I've been, you know, longing to do. Actually, I've been postponing to do it because um, you'll see by the end of this video, whatever tips I'll be dishing out, you'll see that you really, really, really need them before you even, uh, you know, watch my career advice or any other content that I'm dishing out here on YouTube. So yeah, I'm trying to balance my content so that, you know, the other side of me and obviously this is um, related to my, you know, content. So yeah, so, the reason why I'm doing this uh, type of video about uh, self-care is because uh, self-care is very essential because it's even proven, even clinically, so that it eliminates uh, stress or rather reduce stress and depression, your anxiety and all that. And again, self-care, if you adopt or you just create some sort of a self-care routine on a daily basis or just to add on your you know your life whether you're doing it every day or once a week once a month it's up to you but that self-care routine it helps a lot with your concentration at work at school you know it reduces your anger your frustration and all that so without any waste of time let's get straight into this tip so what i'm gonna do is that i'll break them down into physical self-care tips and emotional self-care tips so i'll be dishing out five five which is uh five physical self-care tips and also five uh, emotional self-care tips so without any waste of time let's get straight into them number one is journaling i'm doing that almost every day you know journaling uh, it prepares you and uh, just to go into your day you know prepared knowing what to do your to-do list and all that just you know if you don't have it's never too late to go and buy or you can even do the the electronic journaling way by download some apps so you can google that and yeah so um i'm filming this video it's very late as you can see the 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 lighting it's not even late it's because of a heavy rain that's coming i think it's already started if you can hear the sound of it i think you can hear the sound of the uh, what's this um the lightnings so yeah again um do normalize to talk to a health coach be it a therapist a counselor or anyone that you feel comfortable i don't know how many i have i don't know how many how many uh, of those i've spoken to even currently you know with the issues regards your work your might be personal and whatever it is pertaining yourself do take care of yourself by speaking or talking to a health coach your therapist your whatever because you're not talking to a stranger sometimes it helps a lot you get to unpack whatever without being judged because they don't even know you but you know with me i i i have this i, I don't know if whether i'm blessed or i'm lucky to have a, you know such a health coaches that we really connect connect on on some deeper level so another emotional uh, tip i have mentioned journaling and talking to a health coach another one is exercising someday you know replace it with meditation but i prefer exercising uh, before or after work or it might be before school or after school just to exercise that 30 minutes that depending on 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 you whether you want to do it for i don't know such a period of time an hour 15 minutes 30 minutes do a exercise on a daily because it helps with your productivity your daily productivity gets to be improved and you get to concentrate your focus you know everything just falls into place and without any waste of time let me give you tip number is it number four or oh, this rain is really disturbing me and um i can't postpone this video ever 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 again so yeah 
Another tip is to, you know, um, making uh, use of um, or utilizing affirmations. You know, just tell yourself, I do that every morning that I'm Bashi Mutlanti, I'm strong, I'm beautiful, I'm a child of God, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Let me repeat it again, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. I'm beautiful, I'm strong, I'm, I'm going to pass, I'm going to do this, I'm going to finish this project. I'm gonna, you know, I'm just making an example of how affirmation how you know you can utilize um, affirmations on your daily life and did i mention that all this forms part of a certain routine so this is a self-care routine whether it's daily weekly it's up to you but it's really really important so um the tip number five of emotional self-care routine um it can be you know just practicing a uh, gratitude you know, you don't have to tell anyone about it. You can do it on your own or whether you can tell your um, God or I don't know, just uh, practice gratitude on a daily that, you know, I'm thankful for this job. I'm thankful for one, two, three. I'm thankful for my... Sorry if um, um, I'm fortunate. I hope it's not doing, you know, like uh, too much distraction or damage. Uh, on your side but yeah i think the lightnings are over now so yeah just you know be thankful for whatever you have be thankful for your current situation for in order to get to 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 the next level or your next uh, whatever position you need to be really grateful and to show gratitude for your current uh, situation so that you can receive more or get more so yeah those are the emotional um self-care tips which is journaling exercising talking to a health coach therapist counselor uh, you know exercising practicing gratitude just be thankful you know just be thankful for everything for for everything like uh, with me i'm thankful for all that i have from you know because there's some people out there who doesn't have what we have you know this thing of of being a uh, you know hungry for for wanting more more and more you never get to enjoy your current benefits you never get to enjoy what you have sometimes uh, some things they just pass you by and you realize later that what oh ah ganti you know you need to really stay in the present moment be in the moment and be grateful so now i'll be uh, unpacking a physical uh self-care tips i'm done with the emotional ones and i'll be um you know um dishing out the 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 the, the physical ones so yeah oh my so uh, without any waste of time let me dish out the or rather unpack the physical self-care routines so sorry about the sound of the screen and the lightnings i know it's blessings from god but yeah it's working against me now but i'll be done just now now so this video might not turn out to be the way I wanted it to be, but I'll, I promise I'll do part two. So just try and create a, a sleeping routine and your morning routine in order just to, you know, in order just to, you know, get on with your day and create a healthy diet, eat healthy, have some fruits or veggies on your daily, you know, diet and uh, let's eat healthy, drink lots of water. And it's very hot now because it's summer. And while well, in South Africa it's summer, it's very, very hot. And I become so dehydrated, I've, I've realized that. And yeah, I need to really drink lots of water. Do that also, guys, so that you stay productive. And another tip is to I've mentioned the, 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 the morning or sleeping routine, right? Take lunches, you know, take breaks from school if you are working take a lunch breaks it's very important don't just you know dwell on your work uh, bury yourself in your work the whole day and it's not healthy for your mental and also your physical health so do take walk guys i do that after work and again i do take walks with my dogs it's very very, very refreshing and therapeutic and some exercises after or before work i think i've, I've mentioned that also and you know read magazines you read books i'll be doing a book haul very soon i have a collection of nice inspiring and informative books i'll be doing that so yeah guys with regards to the physical um 
you know, self-care uh, routine or tips, do make sure that you do exercise, you take walks, you take breaks, you nap if you need to, maybe on the weekends you read books, you read magazines, you read whatever might be, you know, food for your soul or for your thoughts. So again, do take walks to the park, do walk with your dogs, I do that. Not on a daily basis, it's tiring and in fact I don't even have time, but whenever I get time to, I do that. Have a bubble bath, have a cold shower sometimes. So guys, I'm not an expert of some sort. I'm, I'm, I'm just, you know, sharing information that worked for me and that is working for me even now and through my you know over a decade of uh, academic and you know career yes i should be the right person to do that and yeah i'm not saying i'm a professional in this but it's really working for me and working for others and to practice those get your body moving get your groove on man you know from me, Majin Atlanti, this way is really ruining my, you know, self-care video, the lightnings and what else, but I do promise to, to take it out soon and I'll do the updated part two. So from me, Majin Atlanti, I love you, do subscribe to my channel and see you on my next upload.